Confrontations come to a head in Bellingham as authorities try to clear a homeless camp surrounding City Hall. Tensions have been building there for weeks as protesters have stood their ground. King 5's Eric Wilkinson is live for us in Bellingham tonight with our story. Eric. Yeah, we were briefed here just within the last hour or so by uh, Bellingham's police chief and mayor. They say they moved in a day early on this homeless camp because they had received credible information that violent agitators from outside this area, Seattle, Portland and beyond even, uh, were planning to come here tomorrow to cause trouble. As heavy equipment moved in to clear the camp that had engulfed City Hall and its surroundings, one man dives under a moving dump truck, apparently to retrieve his table. Demonstrators taunted police, forming a human wall fortified with wooden pallets as police tried to clear the way for city workers to remove the camp. Bellingham police were backed up by sheriff's deputies and even border patrol agents who set up outside the sheriff's office with an armored vehicle at the ready. The camp has been growing for nearly three months as the homeless and their advocates have called on the city to provide more housing. There have been mounting concerns about safety at City Hall with workers being harassed and even a hatchet attack last week. Hans Erkinger Davis Arkansas runs Bellingham's City, base uh, camp homeless shelter. Maximize. He says protesters are doing more harm to the homeless than good. You know, it seems to me like a political move on their part to, you know, voice the frustrations they have at some of the challenges our society has. but. It does not help people in homelessness to be associated with violence like that. My hope is that those folks that are homeless on the ground, that they aren't used as political pawns, really, for, for, um, you know, for people that, that have other agendas. And while tense and confrontational at times, the protest today was largely peaceful. Four arrests, three officers uh, were assaulted, uh, sustaining minor injuries. As for tomorrow, there is a planned protest at City Hall, but uh, at this point, no one's quite sure if that protest is going to happen. But police say they will be ready. Live in Bellingham, Eric Wilkinson, King 5 News.